We're here with Keystone senior Austin Conrad. Just signed your letter of intent to play football at Ohio University. Uh, first and foremost, you've kind of had one of those um, unique situations where you kind of got a taste of the recruiting process a year earlier with uh, with CJ, your brother. Um, talk about how that kind of prepared you for the recruiting process and made it a easier or tougher or what? Oh, uh, definitely easier. I mean, you know, I went on a lot of those recruiting visits with CJ, and you know, you just kind of learn what you want, and you know what you want in the program, what you want in school. So, you know, I learned to listen to CJ, listen to my parents, and uh, definitely made things easier on me. And also you obviously went down to Kentucky and saw him play a lot of times. You visited schools during college, big college games. Getting into the stadiums and seeing that big atmosphere, do you think for a Division One, the Division One program and stuff like that that you're going to be playing with, does that help a lot? Yeah, definitely. I mean, it, it was awesome. I mean, I thought Ohio University has some of the best fans in the MAC, so... You know, and I'm definitely looking for the coaches just with a with a family first uh, attitude, and I definitely think they have that. And obviously, we're just talking to your dad about uh, what they're going to do, what your parents are going to do next year, because you, you and CJ played together at Keystone, and then this year he obviously was at Kentucky, but you were still here at home. But next year, you guys are going to be both playing on Saturdays in, in two different Division One schools. Uh, that's going to be kind of odd. You're going to have mom one week and dad yeah. one week, and uh, definitely. I mean, it's awesome though. I mean, it's a good problem to have. So, um, you know, my parents. They'll split up. They'll make it happen. I'm not worried about that. Any more real now that your name's finally on that paper? Um, I mean, it's definitely just more official. I mean, I've been committed since July, but I mean, I've been looking forward to this day for a long time, so it's awesome. Obviously, nice turnout with teammates, friends, family. Um, a lot of good support here today. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I'm really thankful that everyone could come up, and come out and support. And the recruiting process for you, I mean, I know it's different for everybody, but was it a was it a tough one? Was it a good one? What was it about Ohio that kind of won you over finally? Um, you know, the recruiting process is what it is. I mean, I thought it was okay. Some people like it more than others. But, you know, at the end of the day, I thought Ohio just gave me, like, like the academics. I like the, the football coaches. I thought everything was awesome. I had the family first attitude. And I've seen, this is a big social media day event. They kind of blow it up on social media. And I've seen you on there a lot. And I've seen a lot of, has it been fun kind of just checking the Twitter feed and checking the Instagram and checking the different things where people are, I'm sure a lot of Ohio football fans are wishing you, you well and stuff like that? Yeah, that's awesome. I mean, the sport's great. I mean, you know, I got the, it's like with me, make it the official. There are a lot of the coaches are all like tweet at you and stuff now. So it was pretty cool to see a lot of the other commits and get to talk to them and everything. All right, and like we said earlier to some of the other recruits, uh, there will be Ohio football fans kind of checking for videos and stuff like that. Anything you want to say to your future fans for the next four years? Uh, go Bobcats. All right, thanks. Perfect.